creativity and its importance commerce part 4 how creativity can help in problem solving process the first step of problem solving is to define the problem although this may sound trivial in many cases it is not many people and organizations rush into tackle problem by finding solution without previously knowing that the problem really is so to achieve a solution for one first has to fully understand the problem once the problem have the most important factor in solving it is creativity. Creativity is required in order to create or uh, ask the right questions about the problem and find the correct and appropriate answers to them. Creativity is necessary in order to provide out of the box ideas and suggestions and creativity is what defines the problems of finding a new way of doing things. Brainstorming uh, is a very popular way to solve a problem and it is again strictly a creative, creative method. It involves a rapid exchange of ideas and ideas about the solution to a specific problem. What it does actually is to help people to come up with out of the box. Unconventional ideas and solutions majority of times are the combination of various ideas that are thrown during the start of the brainstorm session. A good example of a very creative solution to a common problem that later became a life-saving method in medicine is the use of ultrasounds. When the first metallic chips and building started to appear, a problem manifested in the form of cracks in the metals that had the potential to resemble in catastrophic failure. The solution that was uh, improvised in order to detect such material failure was the use of ultrasounds. Soon enough ultrasounds were used in humans to may, uh, image their anatomy and monitor their health. Ultrasounds are now used in every hospital and variety of applications such as in uh, obstetrics and ecology and technology. So guys, uh, in CCM, uh, CCM trains students in communication skills effectively. CCM develop appropriate skills in the students as to be competent and provide themselves self-employment. CCM inculcate entrepreneurial skills on the successful competition of the syllabus students will understand the basic concept of commerce, trade and industry. He or she will be exposed to modern business world. CSIM makes the stu uh, students understand modern business practices, forms, procedures, and functioning of the various business organizations. The purpose of this paper is to impart students uh, as understanding of business concepts with a view to prepare them to face emerging challenges. CSIM provides adequate basic understanding about management education among the students. It prepares students to exploit opportunities newly created in the management profession. So guys, join for and have fun. Thank you so much.